Hey guys, Koopa Creator 546 here, and welcome back to another episode of Kirby's Epic Yarn. Last time we beat King DDD and saw some a penguin cutscene. Also, the um. Oh yes. Also, it um cut out a little bit near the end. Oh no, the ship's going down. Wait, why am I watching on that screen? So basically, this is another side scrolling level, except this time we are not in a UFO, but instead a, um, we, it, we are instead on foot. <laughs> oh no! Yeah. I'm, I can only assume there's some sort of good item up there. Yeah, they're probably... Oh, up there it is. Also, I think there's... Oh, there's just some sort of thing. Oh, treasure chest. Nice. We go at... Whee! Kirby lands on the boat safely. Oh, that's not good. That's not a good. And we got a um, patch. That's always nice. Ooh, wait. Another gear. Haha! Storming the ship. It's like, ah, uh, bones. Bye. Or the pirate ship. So as far as we know, that guy could have been the guy controlling it. You never know. Who made that was set off by the king reaction? Um, sort of did, I guess. Okay, what's up here? Nice. Some gold doubloons, I guess. I have a feeling this is gonna be a little bit of a long level. Unfortunately, we cannot get up there now. Or can we? Yes! That was cool. Although now we can't. Because the bees. Oh, it doesn't look like it's really anything, just like a whole lot of bees. Sounds like my sister's been in the shower. Nice. What? Alright. There's time left in the video, so if you like my name. Uh, I'm not sure if she will, but you never know. Yeah. You never know. Oh, that was, that was a big one. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Push him off. Push him overboard. Also, he was alive down there somehow. Push him overboard. Wait, actually, there's probably something up here. And up. Oh my, oh my. We got a pirate ship in a bottle. It's like that, um, one Pirates of the Caribbean movie, the last one. Oh, it's the ref. Put me in, coach. Um, it's like that one Pirates of the Caribbean movie. Oh, yes, also a boss. It's been a while since we've had one of these. Well, a mini boss. Yeah, it's definitely been a while since we've had a mini boss. Okay, you can note to self. You cannot grab those. So, uh, I think it's probably just gonna be one more quick. Oh, my God. Okay, you cannot get that one. Yes! Look at all this treasure.
Okay, I know for a fact that that was not one of them. Yeah, we got it! That's time for the next level. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. Sorry about that. Amiibo. Alright, let's toss this wrench. And fix up this submarine. Yeah, the submarine's good. Bye, submarine. Now we can go to Fossil Reef. Gee, I wonder why it's called Fossil Reef. <laughs> Definitely not because of all the uh, fossils floating around the level. Okay, we do it. Oh, dolphin again. Treasure, yes. Underwater expedition. Oh, that's a new enemy. I guess you can only kill those by, um, you know, ramming to them as dolphins. Oh. First treasure, anemone sofa. Whoa, that was cool. Whoa, I made it. I made it onto the land. Oh, that. Whoa, I did it somehow. Ooh. Sweet fossil, dun dun dun. It feels like it's gonna be a pretty quick level for some reason. Whoa, how is this even possible? So basically, it must be like reverse psychology. I don't know. I'm not a scientist, Doc, but let me just tell you, that's not a normal. Oh, I couldn't make it. Okay. You can make it! Oh! Yes. Wow, it's already the end of the level. Figured that was going to be a quick one. Three stars. I think five stars is enough to get you up to the, um, next rank, I guess. Oh, you know what I just realized? Well, I just realized that we have an item to decorate a room, and that room has a new friend. Yay! So, that's what I can do to finish up this video instead of trying to rush in a last second level. Which is over there, but, you know, we didn't connect it to Quilty Qu Square, so... Yeah, that's a problem. Although, now we can go to... Although, on the right side, now the whole entire world is technically connected. Oh, that's my room. You probably saw the totem pole I made. Alright, apartment number 301. Apartment number 8675309. Okay. No, that's not it. Okay, just change the layout, yes. So, let's see. We'll place the chimney that we just got recently. Well, sorta of recently. Who has a chimney? Inside their house. 
Oh boy, look. I take one look around here, and all I can say is, yes, I'm Buster, by the way. Oh, marvelous Lord Kirby, another tenant who definitely does not look like Zeke. Okay, so, defeat ten enemies. Buster's training. So, we gotta go along with Buster and bust some enemies. Using the Busta of Monardo, I guess. I don't, I don't know the, um... I don't know the, um, thing Shulk is from. Probably don't either. Well, actually, maybe. I don't know. Ah, uh, yes, double kill. Oh, watch out for the archer. This is fun. Although, this is like three worlds in, and we missed an enemy. That's not good. We'll just grab this while we're at it. There's probably one down there. There we go. It falls down. That's a hundred. We did it. Congrats. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Yo, Kirby! Looks like we can try out a brand new training stage. You put on quite a show out there, Kirby. I'm really impressed. Keep it up. I found this out there during our last train session. You want it? You found the sweet dot fabric. Keep practicing and I'm sure you'll be in good shape for our next training session. Yeah. Um. Huh. So I'd say that's all. For, yeah, that's a wrap for now, I guess. <laughs> um. Next time on Kirby's Epic Yarn, we will be going to space. Wait, what is it actually? Oh. Space land. Let that Mario Party two board. See you guys then. Bye bye.